The just discovered metal column stands there, buried deep in the ground, sharp edged and shiny. If today we're able to create a two headed dog with six legs, is it possible that a similar creature existed thousands of years ago? And I say yes. What is this? It's a robot arm. Where's the rest of the robot? I only built the arm. Because that's all you needed, right? <laughs> Welcome back to the Church Ghost Podcast. This Episode is 40. 40. Yeah. We're almost 40. No, so we're not. this is kind of. No, no, we're not. We're actually we're not almost 30. Near. Anyways, guys, it's welcome funny. back. Uh, it's been a. We've had some crazy life events going on. Yeah, so dude. We're back. Live we're back. Yeah. Um, you, well, I mean, you'll see the Rob episode and then another episode before you see the yeah, this one. This one. But we're, we're getting back in the swing at this yeah, point. It has yeah. been. Almost a month since our last episode, and our last episode starts with us, me going, "Dude, I know that the podcast has <laughs> been late, but we're about to, but whatever." At yeah. this, from this point forward, it should go a lot smoother. Anyway, anyways, enough of our welcome back to the cast. Yeah. Welcome back, folks. Whatever, feels, dude. Uh, feels good. We're having a little bit of an early cast today. Um, so it's hurricane, dude. Hurricane, man, dude. Hurricane, hurricane in the Gulf, bro. They call it hurricane. Barrel, barrel, yeah. I call it barrel, barrel, yeah, yeah, barrel, yeah. You want to smoke a barrel? Uh, yeah, yeah, little smoky barrel, smoke a barrel. I yeah, think yeah, if dude. you're any from the south and you read that name, yeah, barrel, it's definitely a barrel. Oh yeah, we're gonna, <laughs> gonna smoke this hurricane barrel. <laughs> barrel, you think just of the regular word barrel? I mean, that's what it, I mean. Essentially, it should be spelled out like barrel. You know? <laughs> yeah, it's like Merrill. But yeah. barrel, even then, it'd be Merle, Merle, oh <laughs> Merle Haggard. You talking about <laughs> Merle? Yeah. Hell yeah, bro. Damn right, dude. <laughs> well, yeah. This makes me think of fucking uh, Robin Hood men in tights. Oh, dude, like, love it. Wait, movie. your name is Mervin? <laughs> like, yes, <He's> like, Mervin. <laughs> like just the dumbest man name. Barrel, Merrill. We have some recent life events. I've had some. Uh, Plumbing issues, sewer issues. Clint's had some oh, yeah, vacation. Dude. Yeah, issues. I had to clean out your pipes, dude. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Clint came get, over the other day. Put my snake in there. Really got his snake real deep. Was, yeah, snake deep into his pipes. The deepest my, any snakes yeah. ever been in my pipes. Yeah, had to unclog them what. pipes. But uh, on a serious note, got yeah, dude, done. that shit was fucking bad, bro. <laughs> that shit was nasty, dude. Apparently, the person that lived there before me just didn't care. Yeah, dude. Holy shit, that. dude. We literally like. We would di- we were digging in there, dude. This shit had to be there for multiple years, dude. We we're digging in there, and literally every time we would pull out, we're pulling out like fucking motor oil, dude. Like the fucking entire snake oh, is just covered in this black, black sludge. Oh. oh, it was so fucking it was bad. Nasty. Yeah, but either way, we got it unclogged. Got yeah. the plumbing fixed. Dishwasher connected. Got the fucking <laughs> new pipes under the sink. We're basically fucking Tim the Tool Man Taylor, yeah, dude. Yeah. We're a real man at this point. Still got all the fingers. Yep. Suck it, nerds. Yeah. Know how to do stuff. Fuck yeah. Real men over here. Real men doing real men shit. Yeah. Fucking with real men shit. Yeah. Yeah, There was was man, real (laughs) man shit. Yeah, real men, men (laughs) men men shit. Fuck. But it was pretty (laughs) nasty, dude. And right after that, I had to go to a pool party. So, like, I went from your Just house. like shit. Dude, I fucking literally, I got my car and I put my seatbelt on. I was like, oh, shit, dude. I cannot have this touching the seatbelt. So, I took my shirt off. And I was like, I know it's on my socks. So, I took my socks and shoes off. So, I'm just driving from fucking your house to my homeboy's house. Steps. Just in my shorts. Just, like, lingering stench of sewage. Yep. I was like, I didn't really. I thought I washed it all off and I smelled my arm. And I was like, all right, I'm taking a shower. Yep. I was about to roll a doobie. I dude, like, I did. You know what? I'm gonna go take a shower. <laughs> I just show up to it's not even my boy homeboy's house, it's his dad's house. So it's like okay. I just show up just fucking shirtless, just no shoes, <laughs> nothing. I'm like What's up? 
I'm gonna wash my hands real uh, quick. Let's yeah, <laughs> go wash I'm my hands. Crazy wild one. It's uh, like, yeah, uh, I'm the wacky guy. Yeah, I'm the wacky guy. <laughs> shows up in swim trunks. Yeah, not even swim trunks. It was just shorts. I had to uh. literally go get my swim trunks <laughs> and change into those. I was just cruising around, just in shorts. <laughs> oh my god, dude! Remember that time we got pulled over? So me and Clint, I don't know where we probably going to get some stuff. What some do you mean weed. stuff? Some crack cocaine. Anyway, so we're in this car, and uh, I, there was this fake like wig that had dreads with a Rasta cap. We weren't going to get some stuff. We just had to go to my bank real quick. Oh yeah, that's what I it just was. had to go get some money out to pay my fucking rent. That's yeah. all. That's all we were we doing. We took a trip to go p- do adulting shit, <laughs> and um, he had this like Rasta cap with dreads. So I had it on for a split second. We turned on the road. A fucking constable, I guess, saw me put the cap underneath the seat. Well, and it, well, what happened was, is my, in all fairness, my fucking uh, tag was out or whatever. Yeah. But we didn't have nothing on it. We literally stopped here and we're like, uh, let's not bring nothing with us, dude. Let's just run to the bank real quick. My tag's out. <laughs> fucking uh, tag's out. Guy sees us, pulls us over, and yeah, Zach's like, fuck. Because I, I thought it was just funny, like the stupid Rasta hat. It's yeah. one of those fucking <laughs> stupid Jamaican hats, Rasta colors, fucking Dread. fake dreads. Uh and yeah, Xander was wearing it. It may have already just been in the car, but either way, yeah. Xander was wearing it at one point. But he had already ta- he, you had already taken it off. Yeah. It was just on the floor. I literally floorboard. I guess <laughs> as he was pulling around, Clint, I I took it off and put it just below <laughs> us. And then the cop pulls yeah. us over. He's like, pulls me out. He pulls me out of the car, and he's like, "So what, your buddy stuff under the seat?" I was like, "Dude, <laughs> it was one of those stupid fucking Rasta hats with the fake dreads on it." Like, we were just like, "All right, this is." We know you're gonna mess with it. you know we know you're gonna fuck with us if you see this thing. It looks like you know like it's just so dumb. Uh, and he, but he was like, so uh, how long have you known this guy? And I was like, I mean, we grew up down the street from each other since we were little kids. He's like, oh, so you know his history, huh? And I was like, <laughs> what, what do you mean, dude? And he's like, well, I'm just saying, you know, he's uh, he's got a little bit of a record. And I was like, I mean sure but i mean doesn't mean we can't still be friends and stuff and he was like oh, i understand i understand you know you've known him for a long time but just you know be careful around this guy now <laughs> be honest with me is there anything in the car i was like no <laughs> dude there's not man i promise he's like all right well we know you were stuffing something under that so i was like oh, dude you're gonna find the hat you're yeah. gonna find the fucking hat and then he yeah. goes he goes to me <laughs> and he's like step out of the car i'm like what the fuck's going <laughs> yeah, on dude. and he like pulls me over like puts my hands like full search like hands on the car yeah. spread eagle pats me i'm like dude there's nothing yeah, like there's you're... nothing like what's going on here and then they don't find anything like, all right have a good day yeah and then leave and we're like, like, what yeah the they were like uh, harassing us too they like separated us to question us yeah like, yeah so what are you guys doing i was like dude i'm literally going we pulled over in the parking lot of my bank i was like dude we're going to my bank so i can get money out and pay my rent that's all we're doing oh my god Flashback like 30 years. We'll probably <laughs> have some weed on us or something. Yeah, but we're actually going to the bank to yeah, do dude. some do- yeah. like adulting shit. Actually, we're paying bills. Actually, so we're doing off. legal shit. <laughs> it was we left so all funny. the illegal shit at the house. So fuck off, Pete. They like ran our licenses, came back, pulled you out. Mm. questioned you about me and then yeah. pulled me out and searched me like they're gonna find something and they, yeah, they were sure, sure enough it was the hat the rasta hat with the yeah <laughs> and then it was like flipped it inside out to make sure there wasn't something yeah. stashed in it or something they're cutting open the dreads <laughs> <laughs> they put it in a bag yeah arrest me anyways <laughs> yeah, yeah this is evidence this guy's got a record let's let's just bag yep. him in it smells like a reefer <laughs> Dude, yeah, that was fun. That was a good time. <laughs> oh my god, we were so. Oh my god, we were doing so nothing, funny. dude. That, that's so fun, funny. dude. That that's the most fun is when yeah. you get pulled over by cops and you haven't. You literally, there's nothing. They got nothing on yeah. you, and you're just like, all right, dude. Except your record. It. Yeah, yeah. yeah except your record. You're like, yeah, I know you're about to fuck with me. Yeah. Go ahead, do your fucking thing, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Look around, destroy my car. Yep. Have fun, ho. Oh yeah. Yeah. That rarely happens. Yeah. <laughs> but <laughs> I mean, honestly, the last probably not no, I haven't been in jail since twenty twelve. Yeah, I haven't been in jail in a long time. No fucking knock on wood. Dude. Cheers. Okay. Last time I was in jail was in Colorado. No. Yeah. No. Kansas. I, no, Kansas. Yeah, Kansas. Fuck Kansas. We don't need to talk about that again. Yeah, last time I went to jail, fucking my wife turned me in, dude. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, mar- I just, married her no nah, i just had a whole fucking um 
I had like an old like a warrant or something. I just needed to fucking. I just needed to go and sit yeah, it out. I just missed court, folks. Just, just sit your time bullshit. out. Yeah, just sit like, your time out. Don't yeah. pay a lawyer. Nope. I mean, if well, the city charge, little bullshit charge. Yeah, it was a little bullshit city charge. So I just went and set out the. You know, like so. Pro tip, kids: if you go to if you're gonna if you have a warrant out for your arrest, plan it out. You go to jail around eleven o'clock. They'll get you through processing and they'll get you into a cell before midnight. If you're booked in before midnight, then at midnight they count your day and it takes money off your books. Then you get out the next morning, and then you just got to pay like two hundred dollars less on a fine. Now the better thing to do is don't get a warrant because even though you're getting a hundred bucks off your warrant and a hundred bucks off your fine, you still wouldn't have had to pay the warrant if you just paid your stupid yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> you know, pro tip is pay your stupid fines. Yeah, pay your but, stupid uh, fines. If not, or go to jail because yeah. that's the worst, dude. You get like fucking pulled over at like. Two o'clock in the morning or something, and you go to jail. You don't get credit for that. You have to fucking sit all the way till the next day, yeah. the next midnight. At midnight is when they count it. Fucking, uh, my wife got arrested for a pipe. Yeah, and I'm sure Cal- Calvi got arrested for a pipe too. Oh, uh, really? Why don't you just snitch on everybody? Cities. Well, <laughs> <laughs> that's fucked up to get arrested for a pipe, right? Yeah, dude. I yeah, I've never been arrested for a pipe, but that's I'm cool with the cops, up. dude. I don't, you know, I don't, I don't know how everybody reacts to the cops, but I, I just. I'm just like, whatever, brother. Just do what you gotta do. Let's not fight. That's my whole that's my whole thing. It's whatever we gotta do to, for yeah. me and you to not fight. That's all I'm that's yeah. I go full submissive. Well I guess bitch, everyone I guess. has different experiences with the cops. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying. Every cop has my... a different view of I've ran into cops that are like you're good, man. Like yeah. you know, like And that's the thing. Sometimes fucking, it's just give me the shit and license go. You know? and, yeah, yeah, you're we're good cool. to go. Here's a warning. And sometimes it's just like like no, get out! All right, of here. We need to get five squad cars out here yeah. right now. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, dude, Whoa, bro, bro. What's that's going a on? Little man? excessive here. It's literally just a gram of dro. You yeah. know, like, like, like. Oh, listen, dude, I'll sit it out. It's fine. Yeah, just put me in jail. <laughs> fuck. Like, this you is don't, no need to call. Like yeah. the fucking don't call backup. Yeah, like, that's a that's a shitty part. Yeah, that's just being from like a small town <laughs> where nothing really happens. Like, I mean, shit has happened. People have yeah. shot each other and fucking everywhere but it like, happens every now and then yeah but for the most part the cops yeah. are just chill just bro. fucking looking They're just hanging out fucking so we get one out. bus tonight if we get all 40 officers you know you get all 25 officers that are up on tonight on the same bus then we all get credit for it boys Hell so yeah. let's all meet up at the fucking you know taco bell we just yeah. busted a stoner dude let's get his ass and his car's a blue sedan here's his license yeah. number everybody remember his face we're yeah, gonna keep busting face, this guy take pictures of him right. every time you see him this dude, is pull Xander. him over. all right this is clint's <laughs> clint's car's a yeah. silver you know like yeah, they so got dead, all these dude. fucking like notes of where we go frequently just to fucking roll up yeah. on us and just yeah dude you're just like like fucking literally just high school student skater smokes a little bit of weed yeah. and then and literally you get pulled over yeah, and you're like everything mr jennings yeah we've been looking for you you're like what the fuck dude <laughs> <laughs> that's some drug king fan dumbass what the just some dude, dude. you want to hear some crazy shit so uh shout out brantley one of our old friends yeah. uh so he came over to my house to hang out and we were just hanging out, you know, playing video games, like whatever, high school. He had left his lights on on his car yeah. the whole time we were hanging out. <laughs> yeah. Um, so we leave, right, to go um, do something else. As soon as we get in the car, uh, DPPD rolls up from, like, North Park, like, from yeah, East yeah. Street, from all ways, yeah, just- guns <laughs> drawn. <laughs> Sir, get out of the vehicle right now. <laughs> Hands up. Me and Bradley are shitting our pants, dude. We're shitting our pants. We're like, whoa. Yeah. The, my family comes out, neighbors come out, and we're like yelling. I'm like, dude, there's nothing. Like, what are you doing? Like, yeah. there's nothing going. Like, what? What? Yeah, like, and they're immediately, where are the drugs? Where are the drugs you know at? Tell me, tell me where are the drugs at? I'm like, if you dude, left your lights on for two hours, you're definitely on dude, drugs. Dude, there's nothing there, sure enough. Bradley was pissed fucking here take my keys you know yeah. search the fucking thing yeah, you know yeah. just fucking do it this is bullshit and then sure enough n- nothing. nothing there's like and they just whoop, yeah they give you some little lecture you need to watch out who your friends are and you know just yeah just know should, that just know that we and, there's a reason we're here today so you need to you need to you know watch out who your friends us, are that's all i'll say a neighbor and they leave it's like tip yeah, fuck you on that there was a suspicious car parked out front i was like yeah, Bro, we're fucking right, chilling, dude. dude. Like, yeah, fucking right, dude. 
they just saw somebody left their fucking lights on and probably smelled a little reefer coming from the backyard and they're like hell yeah dude we got him <laughs> we got this motherfucker dude. that's the worst if you live in a small town that has way too much money the worst yeah they put all of it into the yeah cops. yeah yeah <laughs> if you live in like a, a small town in the like rural i know sure there's chill two cops yeah two everybody cop. knows each other all right dude yeah like you still know each other in a small town but now that there's more like Oh, yeah, fucking, but I'm just saying we don't yeah, know all yeah. the, co- the cops aren't. We don't necessarily. Yeah, we don't they're know not the cops. like dudes no, we went no, to high no. school with. No, they're, they're just fucking. But they know us. Yeah, <laughs> they know us. <clears throat> that was like, dude, one of our homies. Uh, I won't name him, but uh, he was like talking to some girl or whatever. You know, he was like going over to her house or whatever, and uh, he like took his dad's truck over there. It was outside and like outside of her house, you know, like because they have nowhere to go, so they're just chilling in front of the house. Fucking cops roll up and they're like, you know, make them get out of the car and everything. They pull the girl to the side and they're in like, apparently after the fact, what she told him was the cops were like, so how do you know this guy? And they're like, she was like, I mean, I just started talking to him. She's like, what did he tell you his name was? She was like, (laughs) oh shit, Jonathan. I mean, uh, (laughs) beep, uh, bleep that. Anyways, uh, we don't know what Jonathan, anyways, uh, and whatever. And she fucking like, you know, they're like, Listen, this guy's a bad guy, right? Don't believe anything he tells you, okay? He's he, listen. You don't want to get mixed up with guys like this. <laughs> and they like freaked the girl out and everything. He was like, "What the fuck, man?" But like apparently he was Just, on the, he was on their radar like totally like, fucking yeah, we're going to dig, dig This guy's uh, going to end up in prison. Trust me, you don't want to be mixed up in Yeah. Just cock blocking. Yeah. Just, just cock, cock blocking. Block, That's all they were doing. Do you know just this guy's history? <laughs> yeah. It's like don't you like being their dad real quick. Yeah, and it's not like it's not like that dude has even like a crazy fucking record necessarily. Yeah. You know what I mean? Well, it's that's not like the thing, he's like, like some drug kingpin or the cops like, want to be like that guy, that sheriff guy. Yeah. But there's nothing going on. Yeah, exactly. Town. Like, <laughs> like <laughs> nobody's committing crimes, really. So, so you weed? gotta find okay. crime. Yeah. So now you're just creating crime. You're yeah, walking exactly. up, locking up all the potheads. Now, now you gotta deal with pill heads and meth heads. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like Jesus Christ. Oh, so you guys got dogs that sniff are sniffing for fucking weed? Well, I guess we're just gonna sell oxycontin yeah, to each other. Right? Fuck it. Undetectable. <laughs> Anyways, but yeah, being from How a small town, Stros, super man. gay. I mean, dude. What? Like I, I've been. What have like we been talking at the beginning about? Beginning of the season, hey. but all the young guns coming in and stepping yeah. up in big moments, dude. I'm, dude, I'm proud of the boys. Yeah, even the rookies. I don't know who you're, I don't know who through. you're starting in a playoff game. Like who are your guys and who aren't? Because everybody's been so up and down. But like, yeah. truthfully, let's go, boys. Well, dude. we got what a couple dude, months go, left. Boys. So we got a few months left. Yeah, in the season. Not so. worried about it. Not worried about it. But uh, we yeah, got we're about over, to catch the fucking Mariners. We're about two and a half games back yeah, from the Mariners. So Foco. We'll see how it goes. No, no, my confidence in the Astros has not dipped at all. No, whether yeah, we've done we this had a million times. That's what we, we do. We always have a rough start. We all we love to be like we got to work know, out. Not the the, not necessarily a wild card team. We like to win our division. But even if we don't, but it doesn't matter. I dude. will say, Clutch mark my words, city baby. If we can keep um, the records to where we still make it the playoffs and don't have home field advantage. Oh yeah. yeah. That, I mean, we if that's what we got to do. That's what we got to do. We can take it. Do. I mean, home field advantage this year. I mean, I think they could still pull it off because I have no, no less confidence as I. I mean, I just I'm a I like the Astros, so I think they could pull it off. Just because you like the Astros, yeah. So you're just like a homer. Um. It's yeah, a big, I kind of feel homer, it in the bottom of my loins. <laughs> yeah, dude, just right here. It's it's not the taint. It's yeah. more inside, but yeah. it's in that area. It's, it's yeah. what. A girl would call their G spot. Yeah, exactly. It's deep. <laughs> the way I love my Astros, deep into my yeah, G spot. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just tingles it. Yeah. No. Well, I it. feel you, dude. I agree with that. 100%. How are the Tex- what are the Texans looking like next season? I mean, it's off season, dude. I mean. Eh. Same preview we've been oh, talking fucking, about. Uh, didn't Wires, a rookie maybe? Just, just die from the Vikings? Did you see that? I did not see that. It's apparently a rookie that just got drafted to the Vikings. What, do you get like shot killed? up or something? No, I think in a car wreck. Oh, car wreck. Yeah. I mean, that's sad. I haven't heard about it. But, that's crazy uh, though, right? Million dollar contract. I'm chilling, bro. 
Like I worked my whole life, but still I get a you car know, accident, dude. He could have been driving to the stadium to work out. You know, I don't know the whole story, but I mean, true, but it, it's a car accident. Fuck, dude. Depending on the situation, I don't know the whole time of day and the whole situation, but yeah, just don't I mean, go in a car. What are you gonna? Do? How do you, walk. What do you? Yeah, just live at the stadium. <laughs> sleep in, sleep <laughs> yeah. in your locker. I take no chances, bro. Yeah, I'm sleeping I'm here. Cashing this check, dude. Yeah. I'm cashing this first game <laughs> yeah, check. Yeah, I don't I'm give making a fuck. it to this check, dog. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, word. <laughs> but I think it was on the circumstances of he was out, like, Yeah, it's always and, out late. Yeah, fucking, yeah, celebrating. And which, in the NFL. It's not a crime, dude. You're allowed to be out late. Nah, but, but. And I have seen crazy shit. Like, I don't know the situation of this guy, but, like, videos on the internet where it's, like, literally just some dude fucking cruising down the road and just a wheel comes off, like, a fucking trailer or yeah. something and just <laughs> bounces over the median and it's just, he's going 80, the wheel's going 80, and it's just, bah, and just. Ugh. That's it. Not good. End of fucking end of the story, Not dude. Good. Shit like that happened, dude. Man. When we were in Colorado, uh, with with uh, Booba and Silos, mm-hmm. we were going to uh, what is it called? Uh, Cripple Creek. It's a casino. Yeah, Cripple Creek. Yeah, it's called Cripple <laughs> Creek. Listen, and the Ghost Adventures. It's supposedly haunted. Oh, I okay. didn't even know this when we by went. a cripple. <laughs> and then the floorboards be creaking. <laughs> but wait, 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 wait. So it's does he have Cripple a wheelchair? Creek. Does does the ghost? No, is he still in a wheelchair? Creek. Wheelchair as a ghost? <laughs> the wheelchair shows up too. It's just an apparition. <laughs> so we go to Cripple Creek, right? To get there is fucking. It's we're on the mountains. Anyways, we're on like dirt road mountains. Like you gotta. It's it's a fucking trek. So we're going. Yeah. We turn this corner, and there's this guy in a Corvette that has totaled his car against a rock <laughs> oh my god dude that dude sucks. like he just uh, got yeah, the mean... worst wreck ever and me and boomer are cruising around we turn the corner and this guy's like on the set side of his car his like face is bleeding and we're like we stop we're like yo dude are you all right man yeah. like what the f- what the hell just happened he's like I was, uh, just like yeah oh, this shit, fucking just fucked, up. fucked up and we're just like all right and then we try to call the cops but there was no service yeah in the mountains yeah. we're just like all right later <laughs> <laughs> and we're just like uh, uh good luck right, later. <laughs> dude his car was smashed the fuck up we're just like oh dude yeah, wow that's great. like wow this is we need to be careful <laughs> <laughs> holy it shit was that's so hilarious. nuts dude and when we got to the casino um <laughs> there were so many old people there dude it was yeah, so many people were just fucked up uh corvettes dude <laughs> <laughs> everyone had a corvette and it was, they were just all drunk <laughs> it was fucked up dude i lost a lot of money at that casino that sounds terrible um usually what happens though right oh yeah dude i mean we just got back from fucking vegas but dude i remember one time when i was a little kid so all right oh, this is a weird memory I, I haven't thought of this in a million years but like so we were little. I was a little kid, and we were just like cruising it because we were going to like a deer lease or some some fucking country ass shit with my dad, and we're, we're like cruising around, and we've come around this corner, and there's this truck that's just like it's like the old like eighties model Chevys, like the big square body fucking box body fucking trucks, yeah. and it's just veed in, dude. They just fucking oh, just head on a into tree. a tree, dude. Oh. Just fucking just came off that little little <laughs> county road curve and just Fuck. boom and just veed the shit out of this thing. And we're like, oh shit, and we pull over. And fucking some dude just comes like running back out of the woods or whatever. And like we stay there and call the cops and everything. And then the cops are like, there was like other people there or whatever. And they were trying to snitch on these guys so fucking hard, dude. And they're like, no, that guy came running out of the woods. I think he stashed something back there. But I'm like just snitching on this guy to the cops. It's like, oh man, I'm like six years old. So I'm like, yeah, dude, I saw him coming out of the woods too. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, no, dude, definitely fuck those guys. They was, like they just took a corner wrong. I don't even think they were drunk, dude. I think they just took a corner wrong and had something on them oh, and dude. just back to prison. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. Right. God damn, bro, that's fucked up. Yeah. Oh, that's the worst. Man. Yeah, that's the way it goes, dude. That's the way it goes, man. Oh, man. <laughs> that's what happens, man. Don't fucking <laughs> yeah, dude, just... drink and drive on some fucking crazy ass mountain corners. Yep. This one on a mountain. This is just on the fucking flat plains of Texas, boy. Just windy roads. Uh, oh fuck! Yeah, hey, what can you do? <clears throat> no fucking um. Um, 
hate reminds to, me of uh, hate to baby bladder this dude, but I already had to pee again. Really? Yes, dude. Twenty minutes All in. Right. Twenty minutes in. Clint's got to pee. Dude, I gotta, gotta do something gotta, about this, dude. Yeah. We need to get you a catheter. Dude, I just fucking chug beers and then immediately. I have to pee. I'm just properly hydrated. We're hydro bros, dude. We hydrate together. We're hydro bros. (laughs) We're hydro bros, obviously. But I got to pee. Let the record show. Zach peed too. All right? He had to go pee too. And we're back. So you'll probably notice this, but as soon as you said pee break, I hit the pause button. Hit the space bar. On what? On the recording. (laughs) And then I was like, wait, should I have done that? And then I hit the same spot again. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Did you, did you stop the camera? No. Okay. And we're back, folks. And we're back. <laughs> Welcome back <laughs> to the 40th episode. Spectacular. <laughs> yes. I was yeah, I think I got to quit play, playing with my mic. I think my fucking cable makes yeah. noise. Hand off the cord. Yep. Just straight on the shaft. because I do this. I go straight on the shaft. No, you need to be doing, instead of doing this, you need to be doing this. (laughs) Burp on that dick. Um, So, unbeknownst to everyone else, Clint has some notes. Oh, yeah. Uh, This this episode, (laughs) breaking news. No, we've already gone through them, dude. I'm just so seamless (laughs) in conversation that I just slide straight in topic to to topic, dude. All right. Um, Fine. I got, uh, I got something. What do you got, dude? As always. I'll look at my notes. Um, so, s- strange. Uh, no, scientists are testing new robotics with actual flesh-like skin material. So, animatronics with actual flesh. You th- you know where this is going. <laughs> you get, so, they made a hand. A robot hand <laughs> that feels real. No, it's like... Um, right now, it's at the stage where it's just like... A, looks like it's in a Petri dish with like eyeballs and they can kind of control it like what do you like, need eyeballs for make a fucking hand <laughs> right, right, right. No, 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 no. this is just the beginning of it Clint. i mean if, if you were in there if i'm making a robot with flesh-like material i'm starting with the hand <laughs> yeah 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 obviously then I'm making well, they boobs. can't release that they can't release that you know yeah, they can't. I mean, we'll release a funny looking thing if with if i was making eyeballs. this robot with flesh-like material I'm not releasing it either. No, all right? exactly. I'm keeping yeah, that shit yeah, at the yeah, house, yeah, all right? Yeah, yeah. But I'm <laughs> starting with a hand. <laughs> then boobs. For yourself. Vagina butt But hole. to public, you're only then releasing worry about like the other stuff. a weird looking thing with eyeballs. Nothing to really spark the imagination, but you. My a hand. <laughs> a hand. You have a whole smorgasbord of fleshlight, robotic. Yeah. It's not, even, fle- it's not even fleshlight, all right? No, it's not a fleshlight. No, it's fleshlight. Fleshlight. Yeah, no, no. flesh like. But it's happened, everyone. We're about to have moving, talking, walking sex bots. Yeah, that'd be cool, man. <laughs> I mean, I've already accepted the full. It's uh, like uh, as as any invention has ever been like with mankind has ever mankind has ever been invented. Yeah. It's like, can I stick my dick in that? Yeah, obviously. And then obviously, like that's the yeah. first thought. Yeah, clearly, yes. And then they do it, and it's either their dick just dies, or they they lose their dick privileges, or it's very. See, this very is where it gets successful. trickier, right? Obviously, first thought is, can I put my dick in this thing? Yeah. Second thought is, should I? And that's where you're gonna yeah. get a lot of fucking you light know, bulb, a lot of kickback. Imagine you got an open current. Cannot you no, cannot no, put your no, dick no, no, in no. the light bulb? <laughs> hey Jimmy, come should take your you? Dick in this. <laughs> well, you shouldn't. In should the name of science, your, I think you yeah. might. You know, you get your little little cousin. To <laughs> yeah, dude, yeah. And observe it. <laughs> yeah, can and you trick a younger cousin into putting <laughs> his dick in the light bulb? Yeah, exactly, dude. No, dude, I think about that sometimes. So, like, all right, even beyond like robots, which will be great. What it does exist in the here and now is fucking AI porn. So, what you can do is... I haven't ventured that far. <clears throat> you can get AI porn. So, you can, like, subscribe to a site. Just And have it make yourself an AI <laughs> girlfriend, right? So, you can make, like, whatever in your head when you close your eyes, the perfect girl. You can just make that girl. And then, I don't know to what extent, you know, I can't form the premium packages. But... You can make like pornos with this girl and like you can just like 
make the perfect girl, um, right? Yeah. Your preferred version of whatever that is. So like, I'm pretty sure the younger generation is going to be like, so fuck, dude. Like, you know what I mean? I've seen some, um, ug- I've seen some ugly titties in my day. Some vaginas, oh, not so flattering. You know what I mean? I'm just saying. The smell. I've been out there in the wild, okay? Yeah. These kids, they're never going to have sex, dude. Ever. No. Ever. Like and it goes physical? both ways. I'm not saying just boys like, like uh, boys being, making the perfect girl. Like human Girls being, can do the same thing. Make the perfect sex. boy, dude. Or Yeah, or, dude. I'm just saying there's going to be virtual robot fucking AI like people are going to it's going to be judged dread. People are just going to not we're have the last, sex anymore. We're the last we're going to find each other as far as sexual disgusting. intercourse goes. Yeah. So if you're out there and you've been born but what earlier than 2015, let's say if you are just today putting your dick in your hand for the first time, you're probably pretty fucked, dude. It's probably not your the hand. world of and porn. It's probably not your dick. The world of porn that beholds <laughs> you, you know, that is, is before you in your life. It used to be like is it a cr- such Johnny a crazy has level. some fucking Playboy bags. Yeah, it used to be. Yeah, like yeah. literally vagina covered oh, in bush, on completely jo- blurred uh, by bush. Fucking, we used to be uh, just like Japan, but just with bush instead of fucking blurry <laughs> bush. Fucking Joe Rogan was like uh, the whole Starlink with Elon. Apparently, some uh, tribes in the Amazon got. Oh yeah, it was yeah yeah yeah. So, some kind of thing. South America, yeah. yeah. Amazon. That uh, they got on the internet and they were able to look at porn and they. <laughs> yeah, they all get addicted to porn <laughs> right away. Porn. Yeah, I saw a story as about that. As soon as they got able to go yeah. on the internet. And it's crazy because, uh, like, I think Joe Rogan talks about this, but like, the tribe was like a super prude. Like, oh yeah, they were very sexually yeah. repressive. Play like they, they knew fucking nothing about, tied like, their dicks in knots that. and shit. Yeah. Like yeah, they fucking were like, N- we don't fucking do that. Our women are covered. All that bullshit. Only and thing then they as soon as they get porn, dude, that. just fucking. As soon as they saw it, like, oh uh, shit, Mia Khalifa yeah. just ruined their like, fucking shit. Me like, and Johnny, I don't give a fuck. I'm going wild. You know, like, we're, <laughs> we're going full gay, full trend, whatever. And it's funny. Care. It's funny that it's in a backpack. You just show up with the fucking backpack and right, just, just leave it in a tribe, and then they <laughs> all just become fucking porn addicts, dude. <laughs> Making TikToks. <laughs> that's uh, that's basically. That's witchcraft. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like that That's, 100% uh, yeah, is witchcraft. Yeah. Oh hell yeah. That's, like literally you you bring a you bring a bag with this magical fucking you know fucking substance it's inside like of unknown it that causes everyone in the tribe to just put their dick in their hands yeah. and not be able to get rid of just get dick. horny like just get not so horny jerking just the horniness ravages the whole tribe <laughs> yeah dude and they gotta start <laughs> they gotta start cutting dicks off <laughs> see this is the, this is the shit where like all right if some you know meteor hit or you know whatever the fucking some shit happens where like all of you know civilization is destroyed these stories will turn into witchcraft. You know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> like, Yeah, and as soon as you bring them this up, This is the whole like ancient aliens thing. <laughs> taboo, you know? <laughs> yeah. So of course, this doesn't make sense, but, like, if you if there were aliens here building the pyramids, then all of these different, you know, uh, carvings would make sense. You know, it's the same type of thing. Like, what do you mean somebody showed up with a bag ancient full, of, <laughs> full of magic materials that made everybody jerk off all day? <laughs> That's not, that's definitely not real. <laughs> Ancient theorists theorize. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that spike up my hair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can you see it now? Yeah. <laughs> they look exactly the yes. same. What do you see when you see this carving? Clearly you see a spaceship and in front of it an extraterrestrial creature with a spacesuit. <laughs> and a huge <laughs> dick. There's no other way to interpret this. <laughs> He's got the little pin. Yeah, dude. Of the thing. <laughs> that, that oh. a little, it has a Roswell t-shirt underneath a blazer. <laughs> oh, have you, did, you hear, did you hear about the monoliths? Yeah, Those, dude. The, the monoliths. Wait, yeah. what, what monoliths? So apparently there's been like, they call them the monoliths. It's like these, these like super like, um, statues of like a super statue? silver. Bean. What is a super statue? <laughs> it's a statue that's super. It's super duper statue. <laughs> yeah. All right. It's like a of what? Like what a is a statue? Metal of? like prism, like in random. So it's spots. like an obelisk. Yeah, kind of, kind of, kind of. But made out of pure silver. I guess I don't know, but apparently they're appearing around the world just randomly, like uh, crop circles. How Wait, kind of like just... Land of the Lost. Yeah, you remember Land of the Lost? They had, they had the, at least the movie with Will Ferrell. They had those like 
they're literally triangles that are just made out of like basically mirrors. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> and they would just that's show exactly up and you what would open is, up and you go inside. Exactly. So that's there hilarious. was a new one that was released that was in Las Vegas <laughs> and I saw a picture of it and it literally looks like uh, there's pallet jacks. Like 